Hey, this is Jeff Reeves from InvestorPlace.com. Uh, I'm going to talk to you about asset allocation today, how to rebalance your portfolio because over time your investments change. So I'm going to use a working example of uh, Jeff's farm. So we're going to have three asset classes in three different types of livestock here. Um, the first is going to be in chickens. Everybody needs some eggs, some chickens down on the farm. Give them a little fluffy tail right there. Happy chicken. So we got our chickens. Our next asset class is going to be in piggies. A little curly tail. And last but not least, our high growth investment is going to be in rabbits. Because what multiplies on the farm faster than rabbits? A little pointy teeth there. And the carrot, in case you can't tell that he is a rabbit, fluffy tail. Okay, so our asset allocation, we're gonna do just two chickens, we're gonna do four pigs and four rabbits. So as of right now, in our first year, we're 40% in rabbits, 40% in pigs, 20% in chickens. Now Farmer Jeff thinks this is an ideal mix for me in my retirement plans. Um, unfortunately, things change over time. So in year two, our rabbits multiply. We've got 10 rabbits. Pigs are uh, a little amorous. They grow two. We've got six pigs. And chickens go to four. So based on our, our new total of 20, 10 is 50% of 20. Six is 30% of 20. And four is 20% of 20. So as you can see, over time, my investment allocation is changing. Things are growing. That's good. The farm is prospering, but we're getting kind of out of whack here. And then this last year, in year three, the rabbits really take off. So we have 18 rabbits. The pigs, eh, not feeling it. They're the same. Chickens grow to six. So our new allocation that we have is 60% rabbits, 20% pigs, 20% chickens. Now, if my ideal asset allocation for retirement is 40, 40, and 20, um, it's about time for me to sell some rabbits and use it to buy some more pigs over here. So if I want to get back to where I should be, uh, what I'm going to do is sell six rabbits on the open market. Brings me down to 12. Then I got to use those to buy six pigs on the open market. Brings me to 12 pigs. And then, wouldn't you know it, we are back to the proper asset allocation for Jeff's farm. So as you can see over time, things grow. It's a good problem to have, but if you're not paying attention to the farm, uh, you could lose the farm. So make sure you re uh, balance your portfolio. Uh, thanks for visiting Jeff's farm.